Electronics is all around us and the aim of the BSc in Electronics is to give students an understanding of what it is that makes all these things that make our life easy, how they work, be it mobile phones, be it computers, energy and lighting systems that save you money, things that make your cars run more efficiently. So we try to explain how these things work. The BSc in Electronics builds on the physics and maths that students will have done for their Leaving Cert and particularly focuses on how those circuits and systems which build on those basic physical principles are put together to make useful products and save people money and make life easier for them. In the first year, students will cover basic maths and physics, which allows them to explain the physical phenomena and devices that they're going to use and build in the second, third and fourth year of the course. So for example, um, we would use a computer to make a robot find its way out of a maze. In order to do that, you have to be able to think about motion, you have to be able to think about how it is that the robot will solve this problem of finding its way out of a maze, and it also how it can be done more efficiently. How can a computer program be made smaller and faster so as that a device can be smaller and cheaper and more efficient? We've done a lot of work in the last year or two on the BSc in Electronics to make it relevant for the needs of a student who will be graduating in this uncertain climate at the minute. Um, we've spoken a lot about moving away from standard manufacturing towards devices and services. So for example, the electronics of tomorrow is going to be a service on your mobile phone or a service that will be piped directly into your home or a little device that you're going to wear on your person. It's not going to be like the traditional 20 years of working in a company or for a manufacturing facility. So we've done a lot of work in terms of small business enterprise formation. We're doing a lot of work with the Kemi Business School here in terms of entrepreneurship and entrepreneurship activity. And we've done a lot of work to make this electronics program distinctive and current and relevant for the next generation. On graduation from this course, there's a wide range of opportunities, ranging from the healthcare sector, where people will be buying and monitoring and using devices which measure how healthy we are, all the way up to big lighting and heating and air conditioning installation systems in public and private buildings. The postgraduate opportunities in electronics are actually great at the minute and really there's a crying shortage for um, suitably qualified graduates who can do research. Uh, the future for electronics is bright. If you have a degree in electronics you're well equipped for the next generation. <laughs>